It's getting chilly here in Northern California. It's mid-December, and we're wrapping up the fall quarter on the Stanford campus. We're also gearing up, of course, for our spring meeting, dedicated to the future of patient-centered medical education. Of course, I'm talking about MedicineX Ed, April 22nd and 23rd, 2017. In this episode of Everyone Included, we explore interprofessional learning and medical education. Everyone Included is a vision for the future of healthcare based on a framework of mutual respect and inclusivity. We believe everyone should be respected for the expertise they can bring to discussions about the future of healthcare. Here are some of our stories. I first saw Heather Davidson on the Medicine X main stage last year talking about the importance that perspective shifts and aha moments can bring to the educational lives of young doctors when they learn in concert with nurses, pharmacists, social workers, and other healthcare professionals in her interprofessional teaching clinic at Vanderbilt University. I was fascinated by Heather's work as director of the Vanderbilt program in interprofessional learning by encouraging exposure to other ways of thinking differently. She sees her students increasingly respect the expertise that others can bring to the healthcare team, resulting in better teamwork and ultimately leading to better care for patients. We sent Austin Hobart from our MedicineX team to Nashville to learn more about the Vanderbilt Program for Interprofessional Learning and their Everyone Included approach to medical education. Everyone included to me means that there's a strong sense of community, that people are willing to listen to others' perspectives, be open to them, and try to make sure that their blind spots are covered because that's how we solve problems. And that's really what we've wanted. At the Vanderbilt Program in Interprofessional Learning, we're not just a course that you go through, you take an exam, and then you're done. This is a way that the students are building a different model about what care is and the types of solutions that they're trying to find. Our program is bringing together medical students, nursing students, pharmacy students, and social work students. They're going to be able to provide better compassionate care because they understand how each other are thinking. We're watching the whole group of students move from being appropriately frustrated as they really start to understand the healthcare system and think there are many issues to be solved here and I'm sort of mad about it, into a sense of, but we can actually improve. Attending Medicine X was incredibly exciting. There is a sense of community of people coming together to want to openly share with each other the different ways that they're thinking about solving problems. Having the e-patients right there with us at the table was the most exciting part. And I was inspired by hearing people's stories. It was a wonderful platform in which to be able to sit and listen and soak in these different ways of thinking. And now we're starting to think about how can we also have people who have experienced being a patient themselves, how can they actually start working alongside our students so that they can think about solutions that are better. Seeing what patients have to really deal with, seeing what the whole span of a patient's life looks like, you're then empowered to care for that patient in such a richer way because you understand so much more than what the average provider is able to do. We built a panel of patients looking through the emergency department's old records, using that data to probe into who had been to the emergency department over and over and whose needs seemed not to be met by these repeated visits. 
From there, we were able to approach these patients once they bounced back to the emergency department and just do a deep dive conversation with them, talking about what medical problems they'd had, what issues they faced in terms of accessing care, what issues they faced in terms of caring for themselves, and how we could help make those things better. And finally, asking the patient, what is it that you want to get out of your care? What would you imagine your healthcare team doing for you that could make your life better? What we were then able to do was to take all of that data, that rich narrative of the patient's life experiences, and then channel it into a care plan for the patient. We've always been patient-centered, but we haven't moved the extra mile to say, let's bring the patients in with us, the people living with chronic diseases. Let's have them at the table to help mentor the students, to actually say, hey, I've got a good idea. That's one of the real takeaways that I had from being a part of Stanford Medicine X Ed. Having the patients right there at the table provided an open door for compassion. I think that's how we change the world. That's how we do things that are much better than where we are today. I'm Heather Davidson, and I'm Director for Program Development of the Vanderbilt Program in Interprofessional Learning. I'll be at Stanford Medicine X Ed, and I hope to see you there.